Right. So here we've got question five, and there's a part scale for the page, which we'll move on to in a sec. And it says the number of pupils that go on the school trip is worked out. So it's the number of teachers times by eight, or eight times the number of teachers. Well, there's six teachers going on this trip. So the greatest number of teachers and pupils can go on this trip is 34. I'm sorry, it's 54. Okay. So the pupils that go on this trip is 8 times a 6. So it's the formula. 8 times the number of teachers, so it's 8 times 6, is 48 pupils. But there's also six teachers, isn't there? So 48 plus 6 is equal to 54 people. Okay? Next bit. Minibuses are hired for the trip. Each minibus can carry 15 people. So how many people, how many minibuses need to take the 540 people on the trip? No, the 540, the 54 people. Well, 15 plus 15 is 30. So you can, there's one, two minibuses. If we add another 15, 30 plus 15, you get 45. That's now a total of three minibuses, but we haven't got enough space. There's still uh, nine people missing. So you've got to have 45 plus another 15 takes you to 60, which is now means there's enough space. So there's one, two, three, four minibuses in total. Let's move on to part C. Part C says, uh, shows the price of entry into the theme park. So this time it says it's 30 pounds per person and the special offer is three pounds for the three for the price of two. Okay, so three people would normally cost 90 pounds. But because there's a special offer on, it means that actually three people only cost 60 pounds because one of the person goes for three. So it's three people are still going in, but they're only paying 60 pounds. So if you split that, instead of one person going in for complete uh, completely free if you split the price between everyone it means it works out at £20 per person doesn't it? Okay, once you've taken into account the special offer so if each person costs £20 and there's 54 people going on the trip you need to do 54 times 20 well that is going to be 54 times 10 is 540 so you need to do 540 times by 2 which is 1080 so the cost is £1,080 for everyone to go. There's another way you can look at it. There's another way you can look at it. You could think of it this way. If there's 54 people going, it's three for the price of two. Well, you can work out that 18 people uh, go free and 36 people pay. That's how the equivalent cost. So really, you've got to do 36 times by the 30, because that's the price for each person, and then you go, well, it's 360 plus 360 plus 360, which is 1,080 again. So it doesn't matter which way you do it. I quite like this way in blue, because you kind of worked out the saving up front, and then you just it makes this calculation a little bit easier, I think. Okay, So you can look at it either way you like. 